Thomas Carlyle, The French Revolution, July 14th, 1789, page 208, book one, the third estate, not a revolt. Benzenval has decamped under cloud of dusk, amid a great affluence of people who did not harm him. He marches with faint growing tread down the left bank of the Seine, all night towards infinite space. Resummoned shall Benzenval himself be for trial, for difficult acquittal. His king's troops, his royal Allemand, are gone hence forever. The Versailles ball and lemonade is done. The orangerie is silent except for night birds. Over in the Salle des Menus, Vice President Lafayette, with unsnuffed lights, with some hundred or so of members stretched on tables round him, sits erect, out watching the bear. This day, a solemn second deputation went to his majesty, a third, and then a second, second and then a third, with no effect. What shall the end of these things be? In the court, all is mystery, not without whisperings of terror, though ye dream of lemonade and epaulettes, ye foolish women. 